What's going on YouTube? Hello all my tackle hoarders out there. APFA here again with another tank test from Riot Baits. Right there. Today we have the Relic. Why don't you guys take a look at it here. What is it? Cross style baits. And the other end here has got this crazy like spider or tube jig end on it. Um, the information I have on it here, it says the relic is an interfusion of a traditional cross slash creature bait with a spider hub. Um, it really caught my eye when I, when I received this little lucky tackle box here. Um, very unique looking bait. Um, something I would throw. Uh, that color we got here is kind of like a, a black and blue with a little bit of chartreuse in the skirt there. I don't know if the camera's picking it up. The way I got it rigged up today, um, usually like always in these videos, is on a, on a shaky head. We'll get it in the tank and see how it looks. Now the thing I noticed when I had this in the tank before is it's very slow fall. And I really like that. That's not a very light uh, shaky head I got it on. But that's what you're looking for right there. Well, it stands up like that. Any little bit of current in the water is going to get those those appendages moving really well to entice a bass to come up and strike. Um, this is a bait I would fish on the shaky head or on a just like a plain swim jig. Um, it's a little bit small to uh, Texas rig. You probably want to use a three out on that. It's a good way to fish that this bait too with that that slow rate of fall there. Like I said, that comes um, because of the uh, big appendages on there. I'll show you. I'll give you a closer look at those in a minute. But uh, I'm liking what tackle Lucky Tackle Box is doing with with uh, the Riot Bait Company here. They seem to be producing some pretty good. Uh, baits that uh, are catching my eye like this one right here I just like how that skirt flares really well too well, let's take a look I don't know if the camera can pick this up or not um, on the end of these appendages here this is probably the wrong color for this but I'll give it a shot um, it's, it's a thicker plastic at the end here almost cupping uh, water to trap water in there to create such a, a slower fall on the bit. I don't know if you, yeah, see it's going to be real tough to pick that up. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. But you can see how much denser and thicker the plastic is right there at the end of these appendages. And that's what creates that real slow fall. And I really like that. I might actually have to pick some of these up. I haven't really got into riot baits too much. I haven't seen what else they have um, to offer. I take tested the uh, mini fuzzy beaver. That's that's not a bait I'd probably go out and buy. Um, just for the fact that the size of the lure just doesn't really appeal to me. Um, probably you know something like that. That mini beaver would be good on a on a finesse jig or something like that. That's about it. But this has been the Riot Bait uh, Relic. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, like always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. And uh, always keep fishing. And thanks for watching, and we'll catch you on the next video. Thanks.